In this video, we're going to explore how you can use some of the basic functions of legend. And one of them is the positioning or the position where you can reposition the legend here. We can put it down, left or right, anywhere you want. So let's start and explore how you can do this. And this is a really in charge as uh, version number three. And you can see here as well, I think they have here the basic information here. It indicates some setup here but it's quite complicated to be honest so let's start and do it ourselves all right so this is the javascript part here if we go back here this is our site and we have here the html code we will not touch anything here but what we will do is we're going to explore here in this part here all the javascript we need to explore here below this is the one we're going to explore so one of the things that you need to understand with Chart.js version 3, they have changed the structure of that and I already indicated in another video. So let's start and look at that. All right, so we have the skills here. We're going here below. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put in here the plugins. And in plugins, we can now indicate what we want and that's the legend. So they switched legend from options to legend directly to of uh, options plugins legend all right then in here we can put in the option so for example if we would say here display and then we say false as a boolean save that go back here and then refresh here you will see now it doesn't show the legend however in our case we'll make this true and by default it is also true we want to show a position here basically we can do here is a position and in this position, we can indicate exactly what we want. So for example, here we want left. Remember, position is a string because of the text. So we have this here, make sure you put a comma here, indicating for next item, and then refresh here. You can see now we switch and move the item to the left. Of course, this place by default already true, so we can remove that and you will see here nothing happened or it doesn't change at all it just keeps on displaying it and reposition it so we have as well top which is the standard In default mode we can do also bottom we save this and refresh you can see here and then finally we will have a uh, right there we are so they have introduced a new version which is chart area meaning that it will put a position into the chart itself so if you refresh you can see now it goes in here is this practical currently there's no information yet on how you can reposition it within the chart area but it but this would mean it will be working within the canvas itself and and it keeps the chart in maximum size this can be very useful if we can reposition eventually the legend all up here in the top because if you would click here as you can see here it still works however this is not the way we want to do it so in our case right now let's put this here at the bottom so once you save this you can refresh here and there you are so this is how we can use some basic options with legend or how to position it and all these functions you have or all these commands you have for positioning top right left bottom and chart area so if you like these kind of videos and like to learn more about chart yes, check out the link in the description in there you can find my course that goes deep in within everything of chart js